My name is Brandon Hebert. I work at uh, Berkshire Hathaway. Um, I've been selling real estate for about 11 years. I got my license in 2010 and it's just been pretty awesome. <laughs> I like to consider myself an integral part of the process in selling real estate. Um, guiding a lot of people is, is what I tend to do. Um, helping them to make decisions when they're super important. Um, being able to interpret data to help make that decision. I think, you know, being able to go through that process um, and, and people end up, you know, finding the property it is that they want or selling beyond their expectation is, is really satisfying. And um, what's nice about it is that if you continue to have clients, you can continue to do that. It's almost like riding a wave. And, and it's enjoyable. Just recently, my dad put up a video on Facebook of him. He's a blacksmith and he's been a blacksmith, like a farrier for the last 35, 40 years. He started when he was like 16 and he became really good at the trade. Like he was top three in Canada. And um, I just mentioned to him that I'm so proud of him because he's so good at his craft that it's inspirational that you know, I too want to be inspiring to others as well because of, you know, the skill sets that I've created and I have and the knowledge base I have that, um, yeah, I got to say that my dad is probably my inspiration of, you know, having a business and being an entrepreneur, you know, sitting in the truck with him, coming from Pickering and heading to Burlington every other Friday, we would have a lot of good conversations together in the car and he would, you know, guide me as to how to be a good person and you know people are just people and you have to treat them properly and treat them well and um, part of that is probably why he had been so successful as well. My parents always encouraged me to reach my goals whether professional or personal and one of those goals this year was to get my motorcycle license. For quite some time I've always wanted to get a motorcycle since I had my son, I was like, I don't know if I should do this or not, but my girl was really supportive about it. And because of where we live, we're out in the country a little bit. We have back roads, it's not so much city, you know, biking. And, and so I decided, okay, let's do it. I got my M1, I went and got my Ducati, which is pretty sweet, nice little scrambler. It's not too fast, not too powerful, something I can manage, you're okay. But along the way, there's a lot of really beautiful homes. There's like some really nice estate homes that, you know, passing by is kind of cool. And like, oh, I sold that one. And, you know, I, I'm always kind of scouting locations. And so that's part of why I really enjoy that drive up there. So what I found um, to be really helpful in my career is to try to have somewhat of a balance. And that's part of that is having a social life having friends to go chill out, have a beer, uh, talk about life. Um, the bonfires are always really nice. You know, you're headed up to, you know, out of the city. Uh, there's something about nature. There's something about being in the forest and there's something mesmerizing about the flames. And, you know, it's just a good vibe. Enjoy your company. Enjoy having good, solid company around you. Um, helps you reset, I think, as well, because you don't have to think about life. You can just chill and then, you know, you get back to regular day life and it's, it, it's kind of like you've released a little bit of that pressure and, you know, let some weight off your shoulders. My mother, I feel, really taught us, you know, how important family is. Um, she took us to my Nana's every Sunday. And uh, she was the youngest of 10, so there was always something happening at Nana's. All sorts of cousins and aunts and uncles and different characters of people. Without realizing, we really learned how to navigate, you know, quite the family dynamic. Family time is super important to me. Um, you know, having a son and spending quality time with him is one of the highlights of my day on a regular basis. Um, and trying to teach him the way my dad kind of taught me. And the kid loves sports, so we're constantly outside. He's like, you know, shooting a soccer ball or, you know, 
trying to dunk on our basketball net and you know kid loves sports so we're outside regularly we go for walks the the local park is you know two minutes away there's fields there's two schools on either side of where the park is you know having a solid family unit i feel is very important for my son for me for my girl for us to to always be together and and spend that quality time it, it reassures all of us that you know we're living a good life